Topping 12 on health, your child's school cafeteria may be in for a major menu changes. Mm. Government officials announced today proposed new nutritional guidelines. Here now with 12 on health reporter Gillian Ness. Gillian. Imagine schools with no french fries. The guidelines are a major overhaul that would apply to all school lunches subsidized by the federal government. The big picture goal here to turn the tide on child obesity and the high rate of obesity related medical problems in children. I see children who are overweight and have hypertension, have high blood pressure, and their diet does consist of a lot of things that are salty, fried, n you know, little exercise. The proposed new guidelines will mean hasta la vista to trans fats at the school cafeteria. All the deep fryers are gone. These French fries students at Ripawa Middle School are eating today are baked. We serve nothing that's fried in the district in Stanford's public schools. Everything's baked. Hello, Julio. Fresh dill, toss it to incorporate the flavors. And what Chartwell does is food testing, and they have a chef's table. Yeah. And they'll run various products that the chef will cook. I'm the district chef of the entire district. Yellow peppers, red peppers. Government health experts are talking about the biggest school menu overhaul in 15 years. What they're trying to do is reduce the salt, increase the fruits and vegetables that children are exposed to, and also introducing whole grains. They say there are ways around sodium to add flavor to the foods. We have